and it's quite welcome back to the of is in Warfare. So today's episode, we got this cool image right here, and basically what this is is a shower filter. You can see the one that we got right here is from this brand right here, and they call this the SF500. So supposedly for this one, it's actually much more powerful than the previous version or like the most basic version. Like if you guys look at the slide, they probably got some specs and features on here in terms of the benefit as well, and they also probably got some more information on this side as well. So first, I'm actually open this up to show you guys what the inside looks like. All right. So once you guys open up. This actually looks like inside. So a lot of different accessories and different parts, but let's take everything out. So first thing inside, they probably got the leak-proof tape. So you do want to apply this on when you guys first use it, unless if you guys already have it all set up. Next up right here, they probably got a bunch of accessories. So let's take it out. They probably got one of these. They probably got two of these if you guys need to use it. And they also probably got two of these as well. And that is everything in the small little bag. Next up right here, they probably got instruction manual to teach you guys how to set it up and how to use it. And last but not least, we do have the actual product. So let's take it out. So when you guys take it out, you can see inside they also probably got another one of these as well. But once you guys take it out, you can see this is what the product looks like. So for the one that we got right here, we do have the chrome design. They do have this available on other design as well. So you do want to do your own research to see which one you prefer. But here's what the top part looks like. And then here is the bottom. So in terms of the little accessory that we provide for you guys, you guys can slip this on top just like this. And you want to screw this where the water will come out. And I'll show you guys how to set it up in a second. If you guys look carefully on top, they do have the brand logo. But I'm actually open this up to show you guys what the inside looks like. So you just want to twist this open. Once you guys open up, this is what the inside looks like. So when you take it out, this is what the inside looks like here as well. And if you guys twist it, that is basically what the inside looks like. And here is where you guys want to put the cotton part right here. So I'm assuming this one on each side. But let's check. All right, so that's good. Let's check the other side. All right, so also the bottom part has as well. So like I mentioned earlier for this one right here, when you guys do use it, it's supposed to be more effective than the regular version. It's supposed to help you guys filter a lot of different stuff like chemicals, minerals, and so much more. If you guys are curious about what else is beneficial when you guys do use it, in terms of the filter stage, you can definitely take a look at a user manual. But when you guys do use it, you want to set this part up like this, put this inside, screw it back on. Make sure it's super tight. Once it's tight, then it's all set to start using it. And if you guys are curious about how often I should change this in terms of the filter, for me, usually I change it every like six or seven months, depending on how often I use it and what kind of water I use. If you guys do use hot water, then you probably want to change it often. But if you guys use cold water, then it won't be an issue because you do cold water is much cleaner. But that is everything that's on the product. Let me actually go set this up to test out to show you guys how it works and where it works first. And I will come back and talk more about it in a second. So first thing I'm going to do is put on the white tape if you guys don't have one yet. I already have it all set up for white tape so I don't need to put that on yet. But later on we need to put it here so I'll show you guys how to apply this part on in a second. So what I'm going to do is just screw it in. Make it as tight as possible so that way none of the water leaks out. So that should be good. What I'm doing now is apply the white tape. So I think one layer of white tape should be enough. Alright, let's cut it. What I'm going to do now is just set up your shower head. So I don't screw it in. Screw it in as tight as possible. Alright, so that should be good. And I want to set up this part here as well. Alright, so once you guys fully set it up, this is what the product looks like. So when you guys first set a product, you do want to make sure you guys run the water first because there can be something like really dark or like black when you guys actually go through the filter for the first time. So I'm actually run the water and show you guys what the bottom part looks like. All right, so here is basically the bottom of the tub. I'm gonna turn it on and then show you guys what the bottom part of the actual tub looks like when you guys actually use it for the first time. Alright, so I see how the water is kind of black when you guys first turn it on. So you might want to do that a few times to make sure it's fully clean before I use it. Usually I recommend doing it for around like four times so. So I see how there's like the black stuff coming out. And this is after doing it two times. So I'm going to do it two more times on top of this. So after doing three times, it is pretty clean already. But I do want to do one more time. All right, so let's do one last time. All 
All right. So the water is basically all clean now, and you can start using it. So usually for the 15 stages one, you guys have to like run water through it like around four times, and you guys don't see like a dark stuff. This one I did it for around like two or three times, and it's basically clean already. So that's pretty cool. So this is basically what the product looks like once you guys do set it up. If you see it definitely does work. And if you guys want the shower heads I have right here, feel free to get it. So it's basically from this brand right here, and the six different spray molds that you use on here, which is kind of cool. But that is basically what the product looks like once you guys do set it up. Welcome back guys. So I saw a quick test of product and definitely actually does work and actually works quite well. So obviously you guys can see like the process of actually filtering everything and I didn't really do like a full on test to actually test out different sections or different like filter stages. So if you guys are living somewhere where the water is not clean, maybe if there's like minerals or chemicals or anything else, then that is where one of these actually comes in handy to help you guys filter out the water to make the water even more clean. But that is everything that's on the product. Now to go unboxing and test the product. Now the end question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for this part, I do have to say that it's pretty worth it if you guys want one of these one of these. Especially like I mentioned, if your water is not clean and you guys want to filter out the water to make it even more clean, then I do have to say that it's pretty worth it. But then obviously for those guys who don't want, don't need one, or having one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you actually do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.